Hey folks, it's Bill Swift from Swift Canoe and Kayak, and we are in Madison, Wisconsin on a beautiful late June day, and we are at Rutabaga Paddle Sports, and Bianca is here. And Bianca has ordered a Cruiser 12.8 in a special color, and what do you think, Bianca? Should we look at it? I think it, it looks fantastic. I need to see it now. <laughs> okay, she's getting anxious. We've been holding her out on this, so let's take a look, Bianca. So this has been a while in the creation. So let's look at this baby. So the Cruiser 12.8 in Kevlar Fusion. Why don't we do this? That is so beautiful. <laughs> look at this. And Brandon, if you move a little bit, you'll notice folks how the sparkles move a little bit. That is just so this is the burnt orange metal flake finish. And Bianca, honestly, what do you think? I think it's fantastic. It's, it's one of the most beautiful boats I've ever seen. This is, I am so happy to be taking this home. This now, is orange, amazing. orange is your color? Orange is my color. <laughs> I'm a little partial to orange, yes. I, 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 maybe fall, I like fall, and this is the color of fall, so. Now, I know you and your partner, Chet, have had swift boats for a while, yep. and yep. Chet has a Cruiser 15A. Yep. And you guys watched our live show this winter mm -hmm. where we unveiled this color, and we asked people for names. And why don't you tell the folks the name you guys came up with? So Chet came up with Campfire Ember, which I'm pretty happy with, so I think that's what we'll end up calling this. <laughs> And we were giving away prize packs that day. So Chet and Bianca got a prize package of Swift swag. And so let's just look at the whole boat, Bianca. Now, actually, Brandon, can you zoom in on this? Um, our Matt, our creator of this, also put Metal Flake into the skid plate finish when he did it. This is super cool. It's the first time we've done it, and he did a great job on it. It looks fantastic. Why don't you do a quick scan down the boat? We'll take a look at this in the sunshine. So this boat, folks, when you're out in the, on a sunny day like this and you're paddling when you have movement, this boat's got this super cool look to it. So we call it the burnt orange metal flake finish. If you want to call it campfire <laughs> ember or whatever you want, we're all for that. Bianca, you've got a nice smile. I, I am just thrilled. <laughs> this is so beautiful. With the, the black decals, it's just so beautiful. Now let's tell the folks, <laughs> you originally had our pack 12 six, yep. and you wanted something a little bit different. And yep. how did you settle on the Cruiser 12A? So I love my 12 six, there's nothing wrong with that, but uh, when I'm not in it without a lot of gear, if I'm just in it with myself and my camera, I kind of get blown around a little bit and when I'm trying to take a picture, I need to be able to stay in one place and not just, you know, turn on the lake with the wind. So I, I tried Chet's 15.8 and I found that it does not <laughs> turn like that. I mean, obviously it's a bigger boat too, but uh, so when you were down here for the May uh, paddle, I came out and tried a 12.8 and it was, it was absolutely fantastic. I didn't know if I'd have to go with a 14.8 or a 12.8. I was trying to stick to a small boat again. I, I don't have very big arm muscles to be carrying around anything heavy, so I wanted to go as small as possible. And when I got in the 12.8, it was just phenomenal paddling across that little pond, so. So it is a little bit lower cut than our pack 12.6, and it also's got the pull in for oh, the gunnels. Oh, yeah, it was, it was much narrower. Yeah. So when you paddle, it, you've got, you can do more of a regular kayak stroke, mm -hmm. but it still has tons of stability. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. I, I, at no point did I feel like I was going to turn and go in. So, yeah. <laughs> now, you ordered it with the mount package yep. on it. And yep. how do you envision using that yourself? Uh, I'll be using that with my cameras. <laughs> yep. Now, uh, you were telling me you do a lot of camera work. I do. I have been behind a camera since I was about 11 years old. I enjoy taking photos. I am more about landscapes or um, animals. Um, but I just, I, I thoroughly enjoy being out there and capturing the beauty that Wisconsin has or, you know, wherever I am. Now, it's, where do you envision, like, what types of water do you envision yourself um, paddling? Nice, calm lakes or some of the smaller rivers. Uh, we live in southeastern Wisconsin, so 
Um, we've been on the Rock River, we've been on the Root River. Um, there's a bunch of beautiful little lakes there. But we've been up to the Boundary Water, so I can't say this is never going to see that. But <laughs> I mean, that's just not regularly where we'll paddle. <laughs> so why don't you come around again? Let's take another look. And then what we're going to do, folks, is we're going to put Bianca in the water. Why don't you come actually back on this side and put it on your shoulder so and show the folks <laughs> Bianca and this boat in your effervescent... Even somebody as brawny arms as I can, I can lift this up. <laughs> Look at that's beautiful. Well, what do you think, Bianca? Should we have you paddle it? Yes. Yes, we absolutely should have me get in this boat. <laughs> nice. Let's do it. So what do you think? I think it's fantastic. It's, it's exactly what I was hoping it would do. You know, when I paddle the other boat, the last paddle stroke, I tend to continue toward that direction. This is a little more straight handling. So it's just, I, I think it's quicker than my other boat. <laughs> now, how tall are you? 5'7". Five, 5'7". Seven. Five, seven. It looks like it's a really nice size for you. Like it, it's, it is. It's, it's like absolutely perfect. It's, it's not like these are not in the way. The, the width of the boat is fantastic. It is. It's, I'd say it was meant for me. <laughs> now, do you think Chad will be able to keep up to you? Yeah, I mean, look at the size of my arms and look at the size of his arms. He's out paddling me all the time. <laughs> but it'll be nice for you guys to have boats that are compatible with yes. each other. Absolutely, that is nice. Because I feel like with the other boat, I'm paddling twice as hard as him to go just as fast. Yep, yep. So and maybe I won't have to paddle twice as hard this time. <laughs> beautiful. Well, Bianca, you look just wonderful in that, so enjoy it. Cheers. So happy, thank you. <laughs> All right.